later. So it's Christmas even here at the airport. Look at these lights. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking. So, guys, we are finally flying to the south of Africa. Oh my god, I am so excited. You don't even understand. Meanwhile, It's midnight here in Kenya. It is so cold. It is like extremely cold. We are in the rainy season and I'm freezing. That's why I'm having this. Oh god. This is um this is my favorite drink in Java right now. It is uh, ginger, lemon, and hot water. Perfect, especially now that I have a cold. It's gonna come in really, really handy. <laughs> So as you can see, I have layers of clothes because it is freezing in Kenya. So I was supposed to leave the house like this. But since it is freezing, then I had to I put this on. Then still, I was like, no, I had to put this on top. Thank you. Guys, yeah, so this is something new on the menu I decided to try. This is fries with barbecue chicken, avocado, and kachumbari all mixed together. Ah, let's dig in. Twelve seconds later. Guys, I don't think I'm gonna be able to finish this food. I really don't. I've been having a bad stomach. I haven't eaten anything the whole day. Like, my stomach is just in pain. Then I came to this restaurant, I'm a Java and I saw something new on the menu. This. And I ordered. Now the problem is, I can't eat the food and I feel so bad. Like, I don't feel like eating anything. And if I eat, I feel like vomiting. You guys, you know how it is sometimes, yeah? So I feel so bad because this food is over a thousand Kenny shillings. That's over ten dollars, ten US dollars, and now I'm not gonna eat it because I don't feel like and if I force myself I'll feel so I feel so bad it's going to waste but I'm like why did I order the food but then oh yeah stupid me man stupid me I even my brothers dropped me off here at the airport I should have maybe given it to them but they're already gone you know to eat or to take to my cart but i feel i feel like i'm missing so much money it's crazy this food is going to waste funny thing today at lunch time i made fries at home and i just wasn't able to eat when i come here i order fries as if i'm gonna eat anyway two hours later this guys they keep sticking stuff on our passports and then they leave our passport looking like this so by the time you man look at my passports so many things it just looks so unkept but anyway <laughs> yo guys so it is uh, about um 4 a.m in the morning they actually woke me up i was so asleep and i'm so tired it's crazy Anyway, I'm going to South Africa. Finally, I'm so excited guys. I'm so excited and it's freezing. Oh my god. First time going with Air Rwanda. So guys, I made a mistake. I booked my flight, you know, late, last minute. So the prices were so high, up to even a thousand dollars, you know. Even more than a thousand. It was crazy. But I was so lucky to get this affordable flight. I mean, this is South Africa, guys. I'm so excited. Going there for the first time, I couldn't afford to miss it. Guys, so I'm looking for my seat, 1980s now. It's behind. 
just checked in. It's crazy. Um, I had actually dozed off because it's five in the morning, so I haven't slept the whole night. Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm so excited. Finally, it's like the plane. So we're going through Rwanda. So it's like 50 minutes to Rwanda, and then we head to the south. Yo guys so this is my first time flying with uh rwanda air and so i was you know excited i didn't know what they'd serve us but so far so good i love the packaging here so inside this box they've given us a croissant uh tea scone yogurt you guys yogurt and butter not bad you know i'd give them like a nine out of ten <laughs> Passengers are continuing to other destinations. We wish you a flight ahead of you. Guys, so flying from Kenya to Rwanda is about two hours. Guys, we just arrived in Rwanda. Hey guys, so finally we arrived in Rwanda. Um, about 7 7 50 a.m. I'm so excited guys. Rwanda is actually also cold. I feel like everywhere in Africa, maybe in the world is cold during the season. It's crazy. It's freezing It's, it's like it's so cold. You don't even understand Anyway, so my next flight to South Africa is at 10 10 So I have about two hours to go. So I think I'm just gonna edit my video you know and upload because uh, I've been told that the Wi-Fi here is fast that's what the Maya told me so I want to take advantage of that oh my god what do you guys think of my natural hair so I applied something um, it's called edge control and I think it's reacting I don't even know it's white and it's, it's, it even looks better right now it was worse I have wiped it and wiped it off and wiped it off oh man it's crazy but I don't think it looks that bad I'm so used to going to East and West Africa, you know. So it's my first time going to the South of Africa and it's just so exciting. See you guys soon. Guys, so we are heading to Bowen. I'm so excited. I've heard so much about South African countries. Apparently, one of the things I have heard is that South Africa is more developed than, you know, the rest of Africa apart from some North African countries like Egypt. Other than that, South African countries are so developed, so I'm so excited to see, you know, the difference in terms of development, infrastructure, the way of life of people. Um, yeah, uh, it's, just, it's just different. I'm just so excited. I can't wait. So right now in Rwanda, it's uh, heading to 11. It takes two hours, so I should be there around uh, 1. Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god. Can you just leave a comment? Let me know one thing you've heard about South Africa or the South African countries, a rumor, um, speculation, anything, anything. You know what I've heard is that they're so developed. Like most countries in South Africa are just ahead. So and that's what I'm really looking forward to see. Guys, we're here. Yo, this plane is big and people are so many. Look at all these people. The plane is so big and there's no <laughs> where's the line you guys haven't started going in it's starting to rain oh my god guys i can't believe i'm going to south africa oh my god <laughs> oh my god anyway let me go in 
guys so it's my first time using Rwanda Air and so far I'm loving their services uh, the snacks they gave us earlier were right on point they were a lot they didn't even finish so yeah let's inspect these things here so in case you're traveling with Rwanda Air, expect to be entertained. Not only do they have screens that have movies and TV shows, they also have magazines like in Zozi. But sometimes when you take the flight, they don't have screen. Please stop lying to us. Thank you. <laughs> What's wrong with you? That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh gosh. Guys, look at this. This magazine has everything covered, you know. They talk about fashion, business, education, health, everything you need to know about East Africa and mostly Rwanda. We have this other magazine as well called Ikaze Boutique where they show you things that you can buy. Amazing. What do you think? Leave a comment and let me know. Instruction book. Safety instruction card. Guys, I'm literally the last person in this plane. Like, I'm the last one. I'm sitting behind alone. Damn. You know what that means? That means I'll be the last to get food. That means I might, you know, the food might get finished before it gets to me. Oh guys, I really love it when an airplane has movies, especially the latest movies. Oh man, I just love it. Anyway, let's look for something to watch. I think this will do. <laughs> Finally, the food is here. This food looks so good. We have cake. Um, we have, you know, a drink, pineapple juice. And we've got chicken. And uh, broccoli. I love broccoli, you guys. And some potatoes. Oh, this food is so good, guys. I give them a 10 over 10 when it comes to the food. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Kenneth Kaunda International Airport in Osaka. The local time is now 41 minutes past 1 p.m. And the outside temperature is given as 27 degrees Celsius. So my movie is over right on time, just when we arrived. We just arrived, guys are getting off the plane. And I am so excited, guys. landed in South Africa for the first time oh my god the sun is so hot like when I was leaving um, when I was leaving Kenya and Rwanda it was so cold but here the sun is so hot I can't believe it guys I'm in South Africa oh my god oh my god okay guys are looking at me like I'm crazy <laughs> thank you so much for watching guys Mwah. This sign says, welcome to Zambia. Thank you so much.